There's a future at our doorstep. One where old concepts are being challenged, where accepted ideas are being tested, where unknown opportunities will crystallize and fundamentally different perspectives hover at horizons that beckon exploration. And there's a path to that future, a way forward for Africa, a route of accomplishment for a new generation. Ladies and gentlemen, colleagues, friends, donors, donors, without you, this event would not be possible. Parents and loved ones of our students, parents who have provided you with the support to reach your achievements, and most importantly, our law students, whom we honor with this event. Welcome everyone to our Faculty of Law 2021 virtual prestige event. I am Professor Wissal Domingo, the new Executive Dean of the Faculty of Law. I joined the faculty this year in March. Due to unprecedented circumstances, we find ourselves with COVID-19. We had to host our prestige event virtually again this year. As a new Dean, I would have loved the opportunity to meet you, your friends, your family, and your loved ones. My dear students, with this virtual prestige event, you are being celebrated for your academic excellence and celebrated for your brilliant performance in your law courses. Many of you have made this moment possible through your persistence and hard work, through your external and internal motivation, through your love, and I hope love, the love of knowledge and the love of the courses and modules you are doing. Well done. We commend you and our hearty congratulations to all of you. I now have the pleasure of handing over to Professor Issa Fredericks, who will do the virtual presentation of the awards. Thank you for that heartwarming welcoming, Professor Domingo. And without further ado, we shall proceed to awarding the prizes for this Prestige 2020. The first prize we have is the Chancellor's Medal. A gold medal is awarded at the graduation ceremony to the best master's degree student in the Faculty of Law. And this year, the award goes to Jay Ross. The second award is the Cum Laude Gold Medals. The Fitzwani Henny Group of Law Firms awards a gold medal annually to all LLB students who have completed their degree with distinction. And this year, the award goes to M. M. Gudalski, M. A. Scott, and I. Hartley. The next prize is the Etienne Labuskagni Prize. This prize is awarded to the best first year LLB student in memory of the late Mr. Etienne Labuskagni. And this year, it is awarded to N. Ali. The next prize is a Hermann Bosman Prize. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the BCom Law final year. And the award winner this year is JLF Da Silva. The next prize is the Anton Mostert Prize. This prize is initiated by the late advocate Anton Mostert SC and maintained by Professor Frederick mustered in award to the student with the best results in the law of contract and this year it's awarded to R. Grubler. The next prize is the Sheriff and Brecher Prize. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the law of criminal procedure in memory of Ms. Sheriff and Brecher and this year it is awarded to K.R. Heislop. The next prize is the Emil Schlebusch Prize. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in interpretation theory or in interpretation of statutes. And the award winner for this year is S. Suleiman. The next prize is the Judge Franz Malan Prize. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the law of negotiable instruments intellectual property and competition. 
And the winner this year is M.M. Kudalski. The next award is the Judge Sneiman Prize. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the Law of Succession. The winner for this year is L. Williams. The next prize is the Introduction to Legal Studies Prize. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in Introduction to Legal Studies. And the winner is N. Ali. The next award is the Law of Persons and Family Prize. This prize is awarded by the Faculty of Law to the student with the best results in the Law of Persons and the Family. And the winner for this year is N. Ntembo. The next prize is the Faculty of Law Prize for Private International Law. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in private international law. And the winner is M. M. Kudelski. The next prize is the Director's Prize. And this prize is awarded by the Director of the RUJ Law Clinic, Mrs. N. Naidu, to the student who made a valuable contribution to the service that the Law Clinic renders to the community. And the winner for this year is M. M. Kudelski. The next prize is the Elsie Stiernazen Prize for Applied Legal Studies, the clinical component. This prize is awarded to the students with the best results in the clinical component of Applied Legal Studies. And the winners this year are B. Motlaong, T. Maharaj and S. Van Wyk. The next award is the Johannesburg Society of Advocates Prize. This prize is awarded by the Johannesburg Society of Advocates of South Africa to the best final year LLB student. And the winner this year is M. M. Kudelski. The next award is the South African Society for Labor Law Prize and the first year's complimentary membership. And this prize is sponsored by the South African Society for Labor Law and is awarded to the student with the best results in labor law. And the winner for this year is M. Dos Santos. The next award is the Werksman's Attorney's Prize. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in tax law. And the winner of this prize is I. Hartley. The next award is the Werksman Attorney's Prize and this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the law of civil procedure. And the winner for this year is K. R. Heislop. The next award is the Bowman Gilfillan Incorporated Prize. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in business enterprises law. And the winner for this year is M. M. Kudalski. The next prize is the Weber Wenzel Prize. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the law of property. And the winner for this year is J. L. F. Da Silva. The next award is the Nola Hussein Lindsay Prize. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the LLA module Company Law. And the winner of this prize this year is K. Berry. The next award is the Spur and Fisher Prize. This prize is donated by Spur and Fisher to the candidate with the best results in a dissertation in the Faculty of Law in 2020. And the winner this year is M. Nombewu.
The next award is the Norton Rose Fulbright Manley Capitalist Award. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the LLM module Insurance Law for the LLM in Commercial Law. And the winner for this year is Kay Berry. The next prize is the Norton Rose Fulbright Kevin Cron Award. And this prize is awarded to the best third year BCom Law student. And the award winner this year is JLF Da Silva. The next prize is the Norton Rose Fulbright Prize. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the undergraduate module, Law of Delict. And the winners this year are DJ Scott and L. Williams. The next award is the Kish IP Prize. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the LLM degree intellectual property, IP Law. And the winner this year is Jay Ross. The next prize is the Nell Newhouse Award. This floating trophy and cash prize are awarded to the student with the best results in financial market regulatory environment. And the winner this year is T.S. Nkole. The next prize is the Hamisi of Sina Prize for the best second year LLB student. This prize is sponsored by Advocate Professor Takalani Madima, Senior Counsel, and awarded to the best second year LLB student who matriculated from a public high school in Limpopo province. And the winner this year is L.K. Shiluvani. The next Hamisi of Senna Prize for the best third year LLB student. And this prize is sponsored by Advocate Professor Takalani Madima, Senior, senior Counsel, and awarded to the best third year LLB student who matriculated from a public school in the Limpopo province. And the winner this year is P.T. Nkuna. The further Hamisi of Sena Prize and trophy for the best fourth year LLB student. This prize is sponsored by Advocate Professor Takalani Madima, Senior Counsel, and awarded to the best fourth year LLB student who matriculated from a public school in the Limpopo province. And this year, the award winner is M.B. Butani. The next prize is the Oxford Award for Excellence Book Prize. And this prize is awarded to the student with the best results in commercial law, 1B. And the winner this year is B.B. Molloy. The next prize is the LexisNexis Book Prize. And this book prize is made available by LexisNexis for the best student in introductory labor law. And the winner this year is M. Franca. The LexisNexis Book Prize. This book prize is made available by LexisNexis and is awarded to the student with the best individual performance in the law of civil procedure. And this year, the winner is K.R. Highslope. The next award is the LexisNexis Book Prize. This book prize is made available by LexisNexis and is awarded to the student with the best results in Commercial Law 1A. And this year, the winner is K.M. Mamfa. A further LexisNexis Book Prize. This book prize is awarded to the best student in labor law. And the winner this year is M. Dos Santos. The LexisNexis Book Prize. This book prize is awarded to the best student in labor relations and law three. And the winner this year is T. Sehororwana. The Juta Book Prize. This book prize is awarded to the law student who obtain the best academic results irrespective 
of year of study and degree. And the winner is in Ali. The next prize is the advocate TJ Machaba Floating Trophy and Juta Book Prize. This prize is donated by Juta and the trophy is donated by advocate TJ Machaba and is awarded to the best student in Business Law 1. And the winner this year is L.M. Miskna. The Ex-Chief Justice Rumpf Prize and Trophy. This prize was initiated by Ex-Chief Justice Rumpf and is awarded to the student with the best results in criminal law. The winner this year is K.R. Heislop. The next award is the Matthias Nienti Floating Trophy and Prize. This trophy and prize are awarded to the student with the best results in social security law in memory of Dr. Matthias Nienti. And this year the award goes out to M.G. Butani. The Imam Ahmad Ali Fredericks Prize and Floating Trophy. This prize is initiated by myself, Professor Isa Fredericks, in loving memory of my father, Imam Ahmad Ali Fredericks. It is awarded to the student with the best results in international trade law. And the winner this year is I. Hartley. The Faculty of Law Floating Trophy. This trophy was donated by Prof. Steve Cornelius and is awarded to the most dedicated and meritorious final year LLB student. And the winner this year is M. M. Kudelski. The next award is the Janssen van Vieren Floating Trophy. This trophy is donated by Ms. M. Janssen van Vieren and is awarded to the most dedicated mood court coach for 2020. And the winner this year is B. Mapunyani. The next award is the Constitution Floating Trophy for Constitutional Law. This trophy has been donated by the Honorable Judge J.C. Krichler and is awarded to the best student in Constitutional Law. The award winner this year is K.R. Heislop. The Faculty of Law Prize for the Certificate in Board Governance. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the Certificate in Board Governance. And the winners are C. Duploy and S. N. Nkobe. The next award is the Faculty of Law Prize for the Certificate in Compliance Management. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the Certificate in Compliance Management. And the winner for this year is C. Duploy. The next award is the Faculty of Law Prize for the Postgraduate Diploma in Compliance. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the Postgraduate Diploma in Compliance. And the winners this year are B. E. Elsa and V. Singh. The next award is the Faculty of Law Prize for the Higher Certificate in Criminal Justice and Forensic Investigations, the contact component. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the Higher Certificate in Criminal Justice and Forensic Investigations, the contact class. And the winner for this year is S. Engelbrecht. The next award is the Faculty of Law Prize for the High Certificate in Criminal Justice and Forensic Investigations, the modular component. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the High Certificate in Criminal Justice and Forensic Investigations for the modular class. And the winner this year is T.D. Nkato. The next award is the Faculty of Law Prize for the High Certificate in Criminal Justice and Forensic Investigations, the 
The next prize is the Faculty of Law Prize for the Postgraduate Diploma in Drafting and Interpretation of Contracts. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the Postgraduate Diploma in Drafting and Interpretation of Contracts. And the winner for this year is C. Hammergren. The next award is the Faculty of Law Prize for the Postgraduate Diploma in labor law. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the postgraduate diploma in labor law. And the winner for this year is MJ Ndlovu. The next award is the Faculty of Law Prize for the National Diploma in Law Paralegal Studies. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the National Diploma in Law for the Paralegal Studies. And the winner for this year is P.V. Mohani. The next award is the Faculty of Law Prize for the Certificate in Money Laundering Control. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the Certificate in Money Laundering Control and the winner this year is SC in Kube. The next prize is the Faculty of Law Prize for the Certificate in Law and Industry 4.0. This prize is awarded to the student with the best results in the Certificate Law and Industry 4.0. And the winners this year are Y. Pinar and G.C. Jones. That concludes the proceedings for this prestige ceremony. I sincerely thank you for your time and your interest. All award winners, please note, although the trophies will not be handed to you physically, your names will be engraved on the trophy plaques. All the trophies are displayed in the reception area of the Faculty of Law. Once again, congratulations to all award winners. We wish you all the best for your future endeavors. Please take care and stay safe. In closing, a special thank you once again to our donors who have sponsored the prizes and awards. A special thought goes to our donors who have donated prizes in the memory and honor of a loved one who has died. A special thank you also to our donors who have sponsored our students with bursaries and meal vouchers. Donors, we are incredibly grateful for your support and sponsorships of our students and the UJ Faculty of Law. To our UJ admin team that made this event possible, a big thank you. Professor Isa Fredericks, thank you for being an excellent host as always. To our students, I encourage you to remain focused, but become involved in the collective community at UJ and develop yourselves holistically for a future reimagined. As we celebrate this 2021 prestige event virtually in unprecedented times with a global pandemic, I am reminded of Leonard Cohen's poem, which I will conclude this event with. Ring the bells that still can ring. Forget your perfect offering. There is a crack in everything. That's how the light gets in. I wish you all the best. Take care and keep safe. The University of Johannesburg, the future reimagined.